how to make a beautiful girl fall in love with you if you don't have money <laughs> My name is Okoro Blessing in Kiroka, and I'm popularly known as Blessing CEO, Africa Certified Relationship and Mental Expert. I know a lot of men will be drawing their ears to hear this particular one. I know you've been struggling for that fine girl to fall in love with you because you know that, okay, you don't have money, you're still struggling or you're still hustling. Don't worry, I'm going to tell you. Number one, if you are still broke or you are still hustling and you have not made money and there is this fine girl that you like and you want her to fall in love with you number one you must know how to dress knowing how to dress does not mean you have to dress expensive even with your affordable clothes your cheap clothes your okrika your bend down select your china and your abba if you put it together you're going to look very very attractive yes women believe and are moved by the things that they see they like fine fine guys yes they actually want to look at their men and be like okay if you know how to dress and you don't have money trust me a fine girl will always fall for you. Yes! Example me. A lot of women love men that can dress. A man that they can be proud of in public. A man that they can brag with. That's number one. Hmm. Number two. Learn how to be bold. Learn how to speak. Many women love men that are outspoken. Men that have guts. Men that have balls. Men that know what they want. If you see a fine girl and you are well dressed, walk up to her and tell her you are beautiful. They like it. Look for the beautiful parts of her body. I love your eyes. I love your smile. I love your legs. You look beautiful. You're intelligent. Ah, we like it. Whether you have money or you don't have money, we we'll just see ourselves tilting towards love with you yes learn to be bold a lot of men do not understand that when you're well outspoken women love it they like men that speak very well and even if you do not go to school and you cannot speak posh english just be outspoken be expressive know how to express yourself we like it number three know how to fuck <laughs> if you don't have money you need to know how to if you know how to forget about money, forget about money. Sex is very powerful when it comes to a woman. Forget all the pretense. <laughs> I'm not a sex person. Forget it. If you can trap a woman with sex, you can control her. Money or no money. She'll be managing with you. She will love you for who you are. She will quote Bible and tell you how God say you should be patient and he's going to bless you with money. Know how to give it to her. Many of you men don't know how to do these things. And you are now poor. Can you take the two together? Hmm? You can't be poor and at the same time, you don't know how to dress. You don't know how to talk. And you don't know how to knock. How can you carry all the bad, bad things in this life? You not having money is enough. We forgive you because it's not your fault. Opportunity comes to everybody. Maybe your time has not come. But while we are waiting for you to make money, have other ingredients that we can be managing before money comes. Mm -hmm. Know how to. Women love men that know how to. Hey, you see a lot of women that are in relationship and the men don't have money. It is. They have been digmatized. <laughs> so as a man, if you know that you are broke, you don't have money, at least go and learn how to make love. Learn how to touch a woman, not the right part to touch. She will wait for you. You see all these girls that are shouting, I will wait for him. I'm in love with him. My sister, my brother. It is because most times, their boyfriend know how to. At least when you know how to make love, you can keep her. I'm not actually telling you guys to fornicate though, but since you are already fornicating, Learn how to fornicate well because the annoying part is that some of you get involved in sin and you don't know how to sin well. What doing is what doing well since you have decided to fornicate and God asks you not to fornicate, you should leave it for married people since you have started. Learn it well. What did I say? Learn it well. So that's for number three. You need to know how to touch a woman. You need to know the right spot to touch to keep her with you until you make money okay number four no book yes women like men that no book yes if you know book we will stick around you because we will always need you 
Women love intelligent men because if you're intelligent, we'll always come to you. Hey, baby, I can't do this assignment. Baby, this business proposal. Baby, I don't know how to draw this thing. Baby, I don't know how to go about this thing. Yes, if you don't have money and you have brains, a woman would always fall in love with you, especially fine girls. Yes. Develop your brains before money comes. The annoying thing about a lot of men that are broke is that they don't have anything to give. Yes, they don't have anything to give. They are broke physically, they are broke spiritually, and they are broke everywhere. So you need to develop yourself. Why am I giving you these tips? I just want to tell you that being broke is temporal. But most times, many of you men focus on money and you forget to develop other ingredients that makes you a man. When you make money, you are no longer interested. Yes, that's the reason why your women will still cheat over the commonest things. You need to learn other ingredients that keeps a woman apart from money. Yeah, you should. I hear a lot of men say, now money now a woman wants. Yes, we actually do want money. But money is what actually attracts. It doesn't keep. Money is what actual, actually excites. It doesn't make one happy. And a woman always wants to be excited. That's why you give them flowers, you buy them gifts, you buy them this, you buy them that. That thing is just excitement. It is not happiness. Money excites a woman. It just helps spice whatever you feel for her right? It's like when you love people, you buy them gifts, no matter how cheap it is. That's what money does. But the major ingredients are the things you people are losing out, which is what I told you. Learn how to look good. Learn how to dress. Learn how to communicate. Have something in your head. Learn how to have sex. These are the major things that keeps a woman, whether you're a billionaire or you're a trillionaire. Stop leaving the other ingredients and thinking it's all about money, 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 money. When you hear a lot of men right now, they'll be like, I want, to, I want to make money. When you make money, women are going to come around you. Yes. When you make money, women will come around you. Even me, I will come around you, but I will not stay with you. There's a difference between being around you and being with you. So when you have money, you're going to attract a lot of women around you, but you might not have one woman with you. So you need to know the difference and begin to develop yourself. I'm actually talking to the men because a lot of men don't have so much to offer. The society has so focused on the women, 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 women have begun to develop themselves and they forget the male child. So most times when you go to a marriage, you see that a lot of women have so much to offer, but the men don't have so much to offer. So the responsibility is left for the woman to carry. That's why you hear in a place like Africa, eh, marriage is for women, woman, and eh, woman, you see everything thing is woman 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 is because a lot of men have been left out they did not build themselves so no matter how a woman tries marriage will still be hard relationship will still be hard because it is coming from one side and oftentimes a woman can be exhausted a woman can really be exhausted when you give her the load to carry by herself so i'm urging a lot of men that you can attract the beautiful woman when you have other ingredients apart from money. Money is just temporary. Money is just excitement to us. I'm telling you. It is only a poor woman that will be telling you that money makes me happy. Money makes me happy. When you marry her, she will start to crave for attention, affection. My husband is not at home. When you give her money, she can't eat money. There's so many women who are married to rich men today. All they crave for is attention. So money just excites a woman. No matter how much you make, she will still ask you for more. She will still want more. She will still cheat for Fanta, pineapple, meat pie, and small, 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 small things. That's because a lot of women want more. So women don't even know what they want to even add with. So I'm telling you what they want because they don't, they don't, they don't even know what they want. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm urging the men out there to please, please, please put in more effort to developing themselves. When you develop yourself and you know that you have so much to give, you will never be worried. I see a lot of men worrying themselves. Where's my wife going to? A lot of you are just so insecure. You are so insecure sometimes as a man because you know within yourself that your woman deserves more. Yes, sometimes a man is not insecure because you are cheating or because you're unfaithful. A man is just insecure because he knows that you deserve more. And if he gives you a little breathing space, another man could give you that more that you deserve. So as a man, if you want to build your self-esteem, if you want to be a confident man, you need to be able to give a woman more. When you are able to give a woman more within yourself, you will know that you tried. Because sometimes what makes us live in regret is the fact that we do not try.
right? When we do not try, we live in regret. We start to feel like, oh, we didn't do enough. But when you actually do your best, right? Even if somebody walks away from you or somebody leaves you, you would always be excited that you tried your possible best. So guys, I thought I should do you gentlemen a reminder that a woman can actually fall in love with you with or without money. So go develop yourself, go build yourself and become more. I love you guys. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Click the link on my bio. There'll be lots of beautiful intellectual content coming your way way guys you know i also have a date inside and i also have a walking office in lagos you can always walk into our office and talk to a therapist anytime if you want to make some inquiries you can as well call our official number 070-195-11795 if you want to talk to a therapist i'm going to call the number again 070-195-11795 five so i'll be waiting to talk to you i'll be waiting to listen to your story and i'll be waiting to help you and give you answers to all those unanswered questions i still remain your number one relationship and most controversial <laughs> in africa thank you so very much guys for subscribing to my youtube channel i love you guys so very much Mwah. 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 This video is actually on timer and the timer has to finish before I go. Okay, what am I going to be saying before I go? Uh, okay, guys, I just want to tell you guys that I love you so very much. The timer is reading. Tink, 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 tink. I love you very much. I love you guys 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 very much. It's about to go. Love you, love you, love you, love you, love you.